hello guys hello good afternoon you are welcome to my youtube channel my name is kate alexi happy sunday to you guys out there and how are you guys doing hope you guys are good good and just want to thank god for your life for keeping you alive for making you to see a bright day like this it's not easy there are some people in the hospital right now. There are some people who are in the grave. You are still alive. It's something to thank God for. I know you thank God for your life all by yourself. I am still thanking God on your behalf. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for subscribing. And thank you for your comment and all of that. So... This afternoon, I'm going to make a video, though it's not going to be a long video. Um, it's something uh, I observed on my YouTube channel uh, this afternoon. That's what I'm going to talk about. Um, in the morning, I uploaded a video on my YouTube page. Uh, uh, it's about uh, me at Regina Beach. I went to the Regina Beach, so I uploaded the video. It's a short video. So uh, I observed that I had the uh, 94 subscribers. I know since I started this YouTube channel, I'll be having that 94 subscribers for a long time. Um, this afternoon, when I closed from church, I was about going home. Uh, a friend of mine tested me. On the messenger uh, telling me that she has subscribed to my youtube channel that's so kind of like happy I said thank you so you know now I say we I would like to just go uh, uh, pick just sneak and see you know the, the number of subscribers that I have on my youtube page so I open up the youtube channel and I notice that I only have uh, 93 subscribers I had 94 before since my friend subscribed it will be 95 so instead I only saw 93 so I was kind of like what happened to the other two numbers and that's really uh, made me want to do this video for someone to subscribe to your channel, it means somebody wants to hear whatever you have to present to the people out there. Uh, somebody wants to learn a lesson from the message you're going to pass across. For someone to unsubscribe you, it means whatever you are doing is not useful. That's how I reason it. It's not useful. The content is not a good quality one and um, you are talking rubbish you are talking nonsense whatever you are presenting is rubbish and in that way maybe the person is having issues with you maybe the person just hates you or you have done something wrong or maybe you, the content you brought into the page is related to the person's issue at hand or anything concerning that person I'm just assuming I don't I, I don't say it is. I'm just giving different uh, reasons what the one uh, prompted the person to delete him or herself from my YouTube channel. I have no idea. I don't even know who did it. I don't know who the the person is. Uh whether the there are two people, I don't know if there are two, if there are two because the two number is out. So if it's two number, it means it's two subscribers. So these two subscribers, I don't know what happened. I don't know their reason for uh, unsubscribing me. I know that some people would like to unsubscribe. Maybe like the content you bring into the the page is not something they 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 are, they really want. Maybe it's something that provoked them. So I was kind of like. Thinking about all the videos I have made in the past, I didn't see anything that have said to offend anyone. Whatever message I'm bringing, 
into my page is not about criticizing anyone. I never criticize anyone. I only give advice. Yes, there are some advice you can go to a counselor to give to you. You will pay money for it. But ma, I give it freely. But some people, they, I know sometimes two more familiarities can also bring something like that. Uh, like the, my people will say like the Bini. They say, oh, wah, ho, ho, man, I see him. But oh, so he don't see him. What means? When a, 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 um, somebody is not know in his land, but when you go outside, people will respect you. You will not value something that is very close to you because that's, that person is very familiar. Uh, this my own. I don't know. I can't say it's somebody that I know. Like that 94 people. I don't think I know 94 people. I don't think so. I might know, but I don't think I know all of them. All the people that subscribe. There was somebody who subscribed to my YouTube channel. I didn't know the person before. Yes. The person tested me on Facebook, on a Facebook message and said, Oh girl, I subscribe to your, your YouTube channel because um, I got your message on, um, on uh, Facebook and it was really good. It was really good. Something that has really happened to me in the past and I really loved it. And I said, thank you. So this person who unsubscribed me or these two people, I don't know who they are, but I'm just using this medium, this opportunity to tell you that I am not angry at you. I am not mad at you. I am not angry. I am not angry at all. I'm not angry. I know. No, 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 no. I'm not happy with you. I am not sad about it. I am not sad. You know, it's not everybody that will like you. I always say this, and I have said it in my video severally, that not everyone will like you. Even you yourself, not everybody that like, like me. I have people that I like. You know that I don't like other people. If I say I don't like other people, it makes me is somebody I have not met. I might be seeing you on social media. I might say, ah, this person, I don't like this person. But that does not mean I hate that person. If I say I don't like you, it's not you. It's the thing you are doing. That's the thing I will say I don't like. That's why the Bible says we should love people around us. He said we should love our neighbor as ourselves. Yes, we love our neighbor. Do we really love them? Do we really love our neighbor? Sometimes we just pretend to love them. Yes, most of the things we do in this life, is pre it's all based on pretense. Most of the things based on pretense. And people showing it to you that they don't like you, that's where it becomes a problem. Even God himself knows that. We human beings, we hate people that we claim that we love. God knows. He knows that we are just managing to love that person. And he is not going to criticize us for it because we are human. We are not God. Even the, the, the wife, the husband and wife in the house. So husband and wife, they, they, they pretend that they love themselves. Yeah, they pretend they love each other. They... There are some, some couples are like that. They pretend they love each other. They don't love each other. But they are still managing. So these two people who unsubscribed me, I don't know your reason. It might be there is something I have done to you or I said that you are angry. Or maybe you heard something from someone told you about me. And maybe you know me, you are close to me and somebody told you, oh, Kate said this about you. Because of that thing, I want to delete myself. I want to unsubscribe her because I don't want her to get rich. Baby or darling or whatever name I will use. I don't know. Please. I am not angry. If you like, subscribe me. Delete me from your life. Remove me away from your mind. Don't even think about me. If you see me on the road, if you know me, pass by. Don't even say hello. If you like, say hello. If you like, don't say hello. It's not going to give me half attention. You unsubscribing me, it already means you are having something. It's you that is having half attention. Maybe my message is choking you. Or you see my face is choking you. 
and you feel like if you see my face, you're going to get angry and your heart is going to be pounding. My dear, you see me that is sitting here. My heart will not pound. I only don't want to create enmity because I don't know who is doing it, who has unsubscribed me. But your reason for unsubscribing, I don't know. And I don't want to know. I don't want you telling me or bringing message to say, or, oh, this is the reason why I unsubscribe. I don't even want to know. I don't want to know who subscribed. I don't care. But what I want to tell you, dear, you see this YouTube channel I'm doing. I'm not doing it for monetary aspects of it. I'm not doing it for money. I know a lot of people have asked me, okay, you don't do video often, you don't do video, you just do video once and for all, once in a while. I said, yeah, because I don't have time. I work day and night, so I don't have time to do video. The only little time I have, I use it to make video and put it there. I cannot just go and be doing video uh, because I want to do video. I can't be going to YouTube and be looking for video to put. No. When I have a message to share, that's when I make my video. Sometimes I do cooking. It's just a matter of time. And if I have time, I will make video. If you feel my content is not good and you want to unsubscribe, I, I am not angry. I, I won't be angry with you. I know I put like, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Why? Because there are a lot of people that want to hear whatever I have to say. You don't need to hear me speak grammar. Maybe you say, ah, oh, her English is not even polished. I don't need polished English to present anything on YouTube. Some people present a, a message on YouTube through their language. They use pidgin English. They, they, some people, they speak jargons. People still watch their video. Those people who don't even speak Polish English, they are the ones that even get more subscribers, more than the ones that speak big, big grammar. It's not about big grammar. It's all about the content that you are presenting to the people out there. Just like the domestic violence that I, I talked about the last time, someone I don't even know before sent me a test and said, I love that video you made. I love it. Why? Because the person might have been going through a domestic violence. Maybe probably that's why the person watched the video. I know my, my YouTube video is not a large one. Sometimes my, my video, the, the people say the way I put the, the camera. I am not used to all these technologies. I'm still learning. I said the other time, the app that I use in editing my video is the one giving me that long line. You see that my video is always a long line. Like this, this one I'm doing is landscape. Why I'm doing this, uh, I did not do it before. Like if I'm talking on a landscape, it looks as if I'm looking at that side. You know when somebody is doing like uh, they said uh, in Nigeria, they say, look at me, look at that side. So it, the video is like that. I didn't, I didn't want something like that. So that's why I was using the, the portrait. So that portrait, when I'm editing it, it's just stick the, I try to make it like a landscape. It's not working. And the one that, that is good for the landscape that will really uh, make the video look more nice. I have to pay every month. As I was saying, um, somebody, <laughs> sorry, somebody called me actually. That's why I called on the video. So you see, I don't know why the these persons the unsubscribed uh unsubscribe from my YouTube channel. I have no idea. But I just want to let you know that this thing I'm doing, I am not making money from it. And I don't even expect to make money. If money comes, it comes. If it does not come, I'm not worried. I'm working. I'm a working class lady. I'm not the type that will say, oh, YouTube does not pay me. I will not eat. No. I know it's good. Yes, if you can get more subscribers, you are getting money from it. It's good. People really have time. People have time to make videos. They really have time going to YouTube. They are very good in the uh, technologies. Going, checking their phone, their laptop, like all those things. Good. Me, I, I'm not good in technologies. I'm too. I don't have the time. So, um, I don't know uh, why somebody would just sit down. You just say out of hatred or whatever. You go and subscribe. If I'm subscribed now, 
she will not get suspended. Now, Lao, hmm. uh, there's one um, <laughs> parable that says if one yam is out of the pot where cooking the yam, it's one yam is out, does not mean the other yam will not boil, the other yam will not get done. No, it does not prevent the other ones from getting soft. They will still get soft and you will still eat them. So that is life. You if you can't stay because you did not subscribe to my YouTube channel, uh, this lady will not make money from me. If God says, I will make money from the YouTube, with or without you, I will still make money. I have seen a video that somebody will just post on a... Uh, on Facebook or YouTube, they are they will be talking rubbish. They will not they will just be doing rubbish, they talking rubbish before you knew it. That video will go viral and a lot of people will subscribe. The person will get money from it. So you say because um you have something with yourself or who you are you don't subscribe. Unsubscribe, I don't care. Maybe whatever I'm, I'm saying, you don't like it, you sus unsubscribe, it's okay. You feel my face is making you angry. You don't like my face because my face is not beautiful enough for you to see. It's okay, I did not create myself. It's God that created me. Somebody say, oh, you, be, you are like this, you are like that. Mm -hmm. Or oh, you talk too much. It's not me, it's God. If you say I talk too much, go and ask God why he made me to be talking too much. If you say you don't like my face, my face is not beautiful. Go and ask God why it made my face like this not to be beautiful. My dear, this is my video. I made a video to share out there for everyone to watch. To learn our lessons from it. Okay? If you unsubscribe, it's okay. It's okay. It's not going to remove anything from my body. Is not going to make me reduce my weight or add my weight. No. It's not going to make me to be crying. It's not going to remove from my salary that I'm earning. No. You subscribe out of hate. You unsubscribe out of hatred. Because that is the only reason I feel somebody will just go to your video and subscribe. Just like, I don't want to mention your name. Um, I was watching one YouTube uh, channel about one popular blogger like that and she talked about this thing i'm talking about now somebody unsubscribed her and she knew you think other youtuber they, they go to their youtube to check the subscriber how many subscribers they have so she actually checked and noticed that somebody has unsubscribed her <laughs> she laughed she talked about it look at this one you unsubscribe me does it if you see that time, that lady didn't have much people like that, more subscribers. Go and look at her now. She has even resigned from her usual job and be doing a, a YouTube, uh, you know, video. That is it. When God wants to embarrass you with blessing, my dear, you don't count. Your vote doesn't count. Just like when people are voting for a minister, president, and all of that, or the prime minister. Some people will say, I will not vote for him. The other one will say, I will not vote for him. Oh, for now, this person will still win. He will still win. He will still win. You know why? Because God has destined that person to win, to be a winner. When you, are, when you want to excel in life, some people will want to bring you down. But God will lift you up. Because this video is not only about... It, I know it started from subscribe on uh, the the on subscribers from my YouTube people that unsubscribed on from my YouTube uh, channel. I'm just kind of using it to advise those people, and for those who will still want to unsubscribe, just to let you know that it's God. If God has destined you to reach your goal, to reach that place, sometimes you may not even have goal. You may not even propose a goal in your mind or in your heart that this is what you're going to be or this is what you're going to do in the future or this is the state you're going to attain in the future god will put you there that your mind will be wow you like what how did i get here i never planned for this 
you might be proposing it in your heart a little bit a little by little you will say mm, i want to be a doctor ah, but how would i become a doctor i i am not a science student i've never done any science classes in my life and one day you just see yourself just doing it before you knew it you're already a doctor you not be asking yourself is it me that is a doctor there are some things that god will bless you with you'll be wondering you'll be asking yourself like is this me that is in this position then you now remember there are people that told you that time you cannot achieve this you want to be doctor you you want to be a doctor you that doesn't have anything in your brain you will still be a doctor if god has designed that for you and for those who unsubscribe that i'm saying this because of you you feel you unsubscribe me it's going to take something away from me nah it's not going to take anything away from me kate will still remain kate that name will never change will never make me to change my own because Oh, two people unsubscribe me. Okay, now I'm going to change my name. That name is not working. It's a lie. It's a lie. It's a lie. It's just like this thing that happened. It's just like how we human beings are. Yeah, this is how we are. Sometimes we feel like, oh, this, this thing is out of my life. Let me use for somebody, for example. Maybe somebody hurts you. And somebody decide to live your life completely. You now be crying and say, oh, oh Lord, this person left me. Oh, this thing happened to me. Why did this thing happen? I can't live without this person. I can't do without this person. It's the same thing. You can do. I can do without you, guy. If you like, don't subscribe. Okay? If you like, if you subscribe before you go and remove it, it's okay. It's okay. So unsubscribe. In fact, that is not you. If you know me, if you are my friend on Facebook or Instagram, please go and delete yourself from my page. Don't need, not only this one, no. so that you not be seeing my face because this face you are gonna be seeing next. Eh? You know how you're gonna be like gold, the diamond, it be shiny, shiny. It be shiny. You see how God will be blessing me. How God will be pouring His blessings on me. That's what you should do. If you are my friend on Facebook and you are my friend on uh, Instagram, whatever. In fact, if, I, if you know me like face to face, if you hear my name or you even hear the sound of my voice, just run away because it's going to choke you. My voice is going to choke you. My face is going to choke you. If you because if you, if you are uh, subscribing to my YouTube channel, definitely you're going to be watching my video, right? Since you don't want to see my video, anywhere you are, if you know me, whether you know me or don't know me, don't even try to uh, see my face in any places. So that is it. You are subscribing does not mean I cannot move forward, that I cannot go forward. I will ever go forward. Why not? That's it. <laughs> I, I always tell people, when God has a plan for you, nobody can or plan it. That which God has said in your life, nobody can say no. Nobody, no, nobody can, you know, rechange it. That they want to like reconfigure it. They will say, No, I want to do it the way I want it, not the way God wants it. The way God wants it, it will still come to pass. Yeah. Yeah. There are people in this life, they will suffer. A lot of people will neglect them, they will abandon them. They will despise them. They will, uh, they, they will just condemn their lives. They will say, ah, this one is not a human being. This one cannot become somebody. You see that person, you think he will never make it in life. The person will make it. Just like someone that is, that is um, uh, uh, at the age of getting married and you are not married. People are mocking you. Look at her. Ah, she's still 40-something. Uh, she's not married. 30-something, she's not married. They will be mocking you. Those people mocking you. You might even, later when you now eventually get married, those people have been married before, you'll be better than them. They say it's not by how far, but how way. There are some people that just got married. Their, their marriage will be, you know, it will be better than those who have been inside their marriage since. That's how life is. Some people will, that have been looking for a job for a long time, 
they will, the people will be mocking that she is she, she jobless. He is jobless. Oh, look at this one. They will be looking down on you. By the time you have that job that God has designed for you. Those people have job before who have been working for 10 years. When you start receiving that salary, you see that your life will change. It will be better than their own. Just like somebody who has a car, who bought a car. You bought a new car. And that car is brand new. And you see somebody that doesn't have a car. You are like, ah, look at that one that is, that is just walking on a barefoot, no, no car, nothing. One day, where God will embarrass that person with money, the person will buy a better car than your own. It also goes to the person who didn't go to school. You that went to school, you'll be laughing. Hey, look at that one, illiterate. That illiterate. When that illiterate gets up, I go to school. That illiterate. We will speak better than you. That that even think that you are speaking grammar. That's life. How, that's how life is. So I don't know who I'm talking to. Um, I'm just talking this one generally. It's not like even that the people who are subscribing. I'm just giving someone advice now. What if you have anything that you feel is bothering you? The best thing about someone. If you have something against someone, the best thing for you to do is go to God in prayer. God, this person, I hate this person. I hate this person. This person hurt my feelings. What would I do? You will get the answer. If I offend anyone, I always say this. If I offend you, please forgive me. I have caught someone. I caught someone I really love. I love the, this person with, with, like, how do I say it? With all my heart. I am not saying this because I'm on, 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 on the YouTube, because it's a video. I know the person might see it, the person might not see it. I call this person severally, the person will not pick my calls, the person will not return my calls. And I will send a message, the person will not respond. So I don't know what was going on. I never offended this person. I took this person as my own, as my relation. Which the person is not even my relation. The person is not close to me. It's not. She's not my relation. I'm just saying it like like um, singular now. It's one person. She's not my relation. She's not my relative. I've done know her before in my life, but somewhere somewhere along the line we got to become a family and i loved her with all my heart how much i so much loved her this person uh he wanted to that i don't have anything against her really that's how my life is if 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 i feel if i notice something or i sense something from someone i like to call to confirm i call this person and i ask are you okay is there anything i have done wrong the person said no you did not do anything wrong i said okay good and i my mind is cleared if the person had told me oh okay you did this thing you said this thing i will gladly apologize me i lie ap apologizing to people when i'm wrong even when i'm not wrong because you know why i am not good in keeping malice if i'm keeping malice with somebody oh my lord it kills my it kills me i can't sleep at night until I ask you what I did wrong. If you say I did not do anything wrong, then my heart will just like melt. I will just relax. But if you tell me that I did something very wrong to you, I'm going to apologize. Whether you say, okay, apology accepted or not. I don't care. As long as I've apologized to you, that's me. I always follow that, what the Bible says that, uh, that you should, when you, when you, Forgive when you commit sin or offense or what learn to say uh sorry, learn to ask for forgiveness, just like the prodigal son. After he had wasted all his prop father properties, he went back to the father. The father forgave him. We are all human. We should learn to forgive people, no matter what the person did to you in the past, in the present, whatever you feel the, the horrible thing the person has said against you. As long as the person have asked you. 
Did I do anything wrong? Don't fake it. If the person did something wrong, tell the person. Like me, if somebody did something, I've said it to people. I had a friend that time back home. The, 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 that my friend, that girl was always doing me like this, like this, like this. Sometimes she would just be angry with me. Any little thing, you're angry. I was like, I was, because she was close to my heart. I really love her. When I, I have a friend, I love them with all my heart. I don't pretend to, to be friendly to them. That's why I don't even have too much friends. If I have a friend, I always take that friend as a family member. This my friend was doing like this. If I buy something, she will be jealous. If I do this, she will be jealous. Ah, like what kind of friend is this one? But still, I love her. I don't want to get away from her. So she will just pretend that she did not even even when I call, she will not pick her call. That's ah, this thing is getting too much. I called her one day. Please, did I do anything wrong? She said no, 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 no. You did not do anything wrong. No, no, no. I said please tell me. She said no. I said, she said, she want to ask me if there is something I did to her. I said, oh, really? I said, well, I can't pretend that I'm not so angry with you. I'm also angry with you, but I didn't want us to quarry. She said, what did she do? I told her, I said, you are a very jealous person. I hate when I have a friend. If I buy clothes, you are jealous. If I buy this, you are jealous. Anything I put on, even me, I'm not from a rich home. I'm not from a silver spoon home. I'm from a, you know, that Tony Gary. <laughs> yes, I was born in the village. I was born there. I know how we suffered. I can't come and say because I'm in Canada. I'll not say I'm from a, I'm an, I, I, I was an a Jebaco. I'm from a Jeb family. No, Baco. That's where I'm from. I suffered. Me that you are looking at. If I tell you what I did when I was growing up, you will weep for me. You will weep. So that one is for another day. So I'm just like, kind of like saying, um, if you have any grudges with anybody, go to the person, tell the person the person offends you. Instead of just going to the person page, you just unsubscribe the person. It is when you have already told me that, look at what I did to you. And you feel you are still angry. You can go there and delete, my, my, you delete yourself from my page. So my dear, whether you delete to, you did not delete to. I just want to send this to you. I am not making money from YouTube. You subscribe did not give me money. And it's not going to give me money. Thank you. And thank you for those who are still watching my videos. Who just subscribed. Who are still going to subscribe. Please share my video. It's very, very important. You will learn a lot. I am, know I am still growing. There are things I will still have to learn by this YouTube. So I'm just doing it as a hobby. I'm not doing it as a profession. All right. Thank you, guys, my beautiful people out there. God bless you. Those who 